hello hello welcome back to this prophetic word and teaching so narcissism in the church this um topic got i think the most response was same with spiritual gates when i asked on the community post and for me it doesn't even make sense to say narcissism in the church if you think you are in a gathering or the body of christ that you think is the body of christ or you belong to any gathering that you have noticed narcissism present or dominant and you need to work out first of all fast and basically these are spiritual quote-unquote leaders that are manipulative you might be in a gathering where your voice is not heard or is not even considered at all and there's just this um, spirit of oppression going on in where you where you belong right now where you are where, wherever it is that you fellowship so if uh, for some reason you feel uncomfortable and you know and you have asked the Lord and he has shown you that this is not the right place for you you need to leave because a narcissistic leader is not even of God in the first place he is definitely a false prophet a false teacher a false leader that is disguising basically is darkness disguising as light that is what narcissism in the church is about darkness disguising as light what has your discernment shown you have you prayed to the lord and asked him to direct your path to the right place to worship or the right people to gather with because the church is not about the building but the body of christ coming together if you are in that place where there is nothing but oppression and your so-called leader or pastor says do what I, I i want you to do they can quote the scripture but if they are not leaving the word and if they are not even practicing what they preach that is narcissism in the church by their fruits you shall know them a narcissist will always possess the fruits of evil and to never be the fruits of the spirit okay if they do not show you love and patience and long suffering like the word of god has said if all they show you is dominance and oppression and anger and just injustice and a manipulation which is a major tool for every narcissist and manipulation you need to get out of there right now i pray the lord guides you and leads you in your work with him i pray that you are able to avoid the and, 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 and discern the spirit and know that this voice is not of the lord or this voice is for the lord because that is the only way you'll be able to tell a narcissist from a true uh, a man or woman of god and I'll see you next time. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't.